This is an instructional video on how to perform a baloney amputation. I'm Dr. Joe Rapp and we'll be narrating the video of an operation performed by Dr. Jade Hiramoto. The first step of the procedure is to mark the planned incision. This is done by measuring the leg's circumference, then using two-thirds of that length for the anterior incision and one-third of the length for the distance of the posterior flap. The incision is made through the skin and subcutaneous tissue. Although it's not shown here, we make sure to clamp and tie the superficial veins that are cut in this maneuver. The next step in the procedure is to cut through the anterior compartment muscles. This is done in line with the original incision. Bleeding here is rarely troublesome until the neurovascular bundle is encountered just anterior to the interosseous membrane. We clamp and tie the entire neurovascular bundle. With the anterior compartment resected, the tibia is nicely exposed. To begin the transection of the tibia, the periosteum is removed circumferentially. The tibia is then cut approximately one and a half centimeters above the level of the original incision. An Army Navy retractor will be placed behind the tibia prior to sawing through it to elevate the bone from the soft tissues behind it. These will be